It is Saturday, November 3rd, 2018, and we are at 1252 Royal Oak Drive, Winter Springs, Florida, 32708, here in Fairway Oaks, here in Tuscawilla. I am Top Winter Springs Realtor, Scott Garrison with Remax Town and Country. This is a video tour of this beautiful home. We'll go inside in a second. Why am I walking away from it? Because the purpose of this tour is to give you another view of the house that you can't see when you look at the pictures on Zillow, Realtor.com, all the different online places. Those are the best pictures of the place. How do I know that? Because I am the one who took and posted those pictures. So this will give you another view, including the neighborhood that you can't normally see. If you want to say, what it's really like to live here. Most important thing to say as we're going towards the entrance here is that we are in Tuscawilla, Country Club neighborhood. And everyone in East Orlando, if you say I live in Tuscawilla, they're like, oh, super prestigious, just in the name. Beautiful place to drive in and out of. We're at the entrance to a subdivision here in Tuscawilla, Fairway Oaks, corner of Northern Way and Royal Oak. So of course it's just a road. But, one of the things you'll notice, it's a road full of nice houses, big trees, no stores, no billboards. This is the kind of living that people come to Orlando and Winter Springs for. So I want you to get a chance to check out some of the neighbors, see the house. We'll go out on the golf course, we'll look inside, upstairs, downstairs as well. So you've been looking here in... Tuscawilla. You're looking here in Winter Springs and you see some gorgeous houses and you say, why do they sell so fast? It's because that when you are looking for a certain kind of house, you contact a realtor like me and I'll set up a search for you. So that when just your kind of home and your price range in your area with your school system, your square footage, your bedrooms, baths, square year built comes on, you get automatically notified. And buyers in the know would use this free service of mine so that they don't miss a house. Because by the time you notice it on Zillow or something like that, it's usually five, eight days in the market. And a lot of times the good ones are gone. So contact me if you're looking for a certain kind of house here in Winter Springs, East Orlando, Tuscawilla, or obviously right here as well in Fairway Oaks. Obviously I'm committed to the area and the neighborhood. The HOA here is $2.99 a quarter, which translates into hundred dollars a month. And you were getting the feel that it's quiet. This is the middle of Saturday afternoon. It's probably as noisy as it gets. Nice trees. Look at your neighbor's tree there. And you can see the backyard of this one is unbelievable. Now, for those of you watching at home, you're noticing what's that big white line between the houses. That is a firewall. This is, according to the public records, a single-family home. It is attached to that concrete block firewall there. So you get two homes next to each other. And right here is the only time you can even tell. Otherwise, it's super private. It's actually probably more private than a regular single-family home. You can see that upgraded St. Augustine grass. Nice and green and thick. This house was built in 1980. So you see the 1980s construction, that uh, coral, I think it is, stone, is very popular throughout the whole region here. So we're actually going to run around through the neighbor's yard to get to the back. Now this house that we're going to look at here is four bedrooms. Two and a half baths. Upstairs, downstairs, downstairs master. Look at that. That is beautiful. I'm taking the video right into the sun there. This is gonna give you a feel for the peace, the quiet, tranquility. Just amazing. So you look at that house, even into the sun. Can't even tell there's a house next door, of course. Low maintenance yard, lots of green ferns, lush trees, and a view of the 14th hole. 
here in this golf front house. Absolutely beautiful. Never actually been out here a couple of times, never actually seen anyone play golf here. Not sure why, but it's well maintained, so maybe that's even better. So coming up on the 14th hole, see a lot of pride of ownership. These nice expensive houses, getting new roofs on, even today. And that's what you hear in the background. So we are on the 14th hole, on the fairway. Your house is right there. And other than the nail gun going off in the background, pretty peaceful. All right, I'm gonna go around to the front and we will go inside. We're gonna walk in up to the front door. Nice curvy entrance sidewalk, good for feng shui. That's still a thing. Beautiful entrance, and most importantly, what a nice entry. Welcome home. Four bedrooms, two and a half baths, master downstairs, 25, 14 square feet, a little over 3,000 square feet, including the slab, which are the two porches and the garage. This is just about as cute as you could possibly make it. Look at this. Got the wet bar, which is a super popular thing in the 80s when these were being built. Half bath right there, and the kitchen, nice and bright, Just adorable. So many neat features to the house. Stand in here, your view, you've got that atrium is open to the outside, gives you all that nice sunlight. And obviously a great place to grill as well. Now we're going into the master suite. What a view. Wake up every day, 14th hole, golf course, privacy, that's you. Step out here. This is your classic Florida room. Look at that beautiful ceiling. Those are windows, not screens. So this is part of the air-conditioned space. The perfect tile for this. Give you that outside feel indoors. And of course that could be your life right here. That's your view. Way better having some neighbors in the back. Jumping back into the master. Going back into the master bath, which has just been so well kept. And definitely reminds you of the 80s. Look at that cute little tile. This was the thing, still is right here. 
Look at that window to the atrium. So you've got lots of ventilation. Sunken bath or shower. And of course your own private throne room. Mirrors. Give that place that airy feeling of space. And coming out of the master, we're not done yet with the downstairs. First, tip over to the garage, washer and dryer out here. And no matter what you do to a garage, you never get someone to come out and say, how cute. But this is about as close as you can get to a good looking cute garage. Got the half bath, downstairs bath, guest bath. What makes it a half bath is no shower. We're gonna go back to the garage for a second because I've got to point something out. Hold on. Okay, the miracle of time-lapse photography. What I want to point out is right there. See that? That is an AC vent. See that ceiling? That is no popcorn. That is flat and smooth. That's a big job. This was originally a model home. They had their sales office here. Sellers had removed that popcorn, which usually falls down in a home this age, makes it look brand new. Look at that. Even some type of almost like a crown molding coming up. And the AC vent means if you open that AC vent up, your garage is air conditioned. So you can have your own model home or work on cars or turn it into extra living space. And you don't even have to redo the AC. This is pretty cool here. Oh, it's just a closet, but it's a cedar closet. Look at that. Everyone wants their own cedar line closet. Got one here. Very close to Harry Potter's closet under the stairs. Just not quite under the stairs. Here's the part, hopefully, where I make it up the actual stairs without falling and then end up on America's Home Videos. Made it. Look at the nice touches. Isn't that just beautiful? The tree in the distance. Nice lights. A really big bedroom here, which is turned into of course, the office. It's the view out these windows that people really like. These windows do have a special coating on them through 3M that makes them uh, shatter and break resistant, makes them extra strong so the glass won't shatter. Also has some, way around the corner here, has some window tinting in them as well. That was a big upgrade. So you can see this is a nice size room. Those are permanently attached. I'm sure you could take them down if you wanted, but that's a heck of a bookshelf. All right, this would be bedroom number three, we call it. Decorated like a little bed and breakfast. So cute. Nice view out the window. We've got zoned AC, so it's cool up here, unlike other two-story homes. We come upstairs and it's hot. This has got its own AC, which you don't have to run if you're not going to use upstairs much. This is just so beachy, so cute. Look at that. And those are, of course, permanent built-ins. Got the closet behind the door. And we come around to the beachy bath. The original tile still looks brand new. This cute little step up bathroom. You step up, kind of like being in an attic. It's got such a neat feel to it. Window, light, that tub looks brand new. So if I can help you with this home or another home like it, call me, Realtor Scott Garrison, 407-339-3200. Thanks.